Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft PowerPoint. In this module, I want to show you how you can create your own theme and then set that theme to be the default theme every time you open PowerPoint. So on the screen, I have a blank PowerPoint. And if I drop this little arrow down where the themes are, so on the design tab, you can see that I've got some themes here and that says default. And that's got my company logo on it. So I've basically created that theme and then saved it in here and also then right clicked on it and set it as default so every time i open a new powerpoint presentation this appears and as my default theme but to create a theme from scratch this is what you can do you go to the view tab you go into slide master that's the back side of any presentation it's also the place you should come to change fonts and styles and layout and etc put logos and stuff like that Got loads of videos on slide master but in here you've got themes these are the preset themes that i've just showed you on the design tab but you've got the options through these options to create your own theme so that's what i've done before weren't great but i'm going to create a new one a better color scheme than that so you go down to the bottom custom colors and then you get these sort of options here with previews there to see what this is going to look like so if i just mess about with this a little bit you can see what it'll do if I click on that, the text changes. If I change the white to something that stands out differently, see how that changed there. Background color, if I change that to white, that's what that's just done. If I do that one to white as well, you can see how that's changed it. Then you've got these accents. If you change these, I'll change that. The first one is blue, so I'll change it to green. So that one there, little one there, changed to green. And you basically just go through this and change these to the to this theme that you want and then once you're happy with that you give it a name at the bottom there so i'll call this steve and then save that so that's the colors that i've saved for this now the fonts the same process applies for the fonts now i've created that one already but i'll do another one so custom fonts i'll go for tahoma again because i like it so that's going to be tahoma and then you've got the body font as well that was a title so to homer again click on that so the whole thing is to homer and then i'll just type that as a name so i know what it is it'll, it'll tell me that anyhow but i'll save that so i've now created the font you've also got these sort of um, effect styles like so and then if i just go back into this you can see if you don't like it you can go back into it and change it or, or just delete the whole thing if you don't like it at all but what i want to do now is save this as a theme so it's pretty garish i do know that but there you go easy to see so what you do now is you do down the bottom here you go save current theme which is what we've just done so i'll save that and i'll call it test 2. it goes into your document themes click on save and then that should sit in there. Now, if I go Control N to get myself a new file and then go to design, what I should see there is test two. So that's an older one. That's test two. So I can click on that theme. So that theme is now on this presentation. But if I, if I right click on that theme, you can then set that as default, which I don't want to do because it'll overwrite this one. But notice that my logo came through on that theme because when I was in Slide Master View, I still had my logo on that. If I close this down, don't save it. You see, it's already on that top slide, so this is there. And that's part of this theme that I've added in there. So it's not just colors and fonts, it's all sorts of stuff that you can utilize. So that's very a quick video of how you can create themes in PowerPoint. It's very similar in Access as well. Hopefully that video was of use. Thank you for your time and I'll catch you in the next one.